my name is Liz Alpert. I work for Hamtramck Public Schools as a school and community facilitator and the homeless liaison for the district. We're here today at Pulaski Park in Hamtramck with our HPS Family Fun Fair. Um, we're doing this today for all of our students and families to get them excited to come back to school. And we have all of our schools here, all of our different departments um, within the district. And then we also have um, about 20 to 30 different local agencies here to provide resources for our families, school supplies, backpacks, um, all kinds of different things to help our families get what they need to be ready and successful for back to school. How long have you been organizing such events? This is my third year doing this event. Um, I started working with the district in February 2021. Um, I know they had a, something similar to this before I came, so this might be the fifth year total, but this is my third year organizing and running the event. Who's sponsoring this event? And do we have any sponsors from the outside? This whole event is sponsored by Hamtramck Public Schools. Uh, my department has a budget that we use to, to pay for all of the food that the vendors got and all of the decorations and supplies. All of the vendors are invited to come for free um, and the recreation department also provided us with a, a budget to use as well. My name is Shannon and I work with the Hamtramck Drug Free Community Coalition. Today we are at the Hamtramck Fun Fair and we are giving out many, many things. So so we have with us today Sarah and then Marge and we have Lara over here and Pushpita is with us. She's our media intern who works at the high school or she goes to the high school and works with us in the summer and through the school year. And then we have Michelle as well. And today we are giving away little magnets that have different Helpline numbers on them. These are for parents as well as an informational flyer for anyone that wants to know more about us. And we also have little erasers for the students that have our logo on them. And then a ruler as well for our new students coming into the school year, as well as a pencil sharpener, which Laura is holding. And then over there, we also have a sticker sheet, which I can show you in a second. We have a sticker sheet here that's for our younger kids with some positive messaging as well. And then we do also have a don't text and drive keychain that's more for our older students, especially those going into high school. And also our parents, just as a reminder, not to use your phone while driving. So that's what we have with us today. So I work with the Hamtramck Drug Free Community Coalition and we work very closely with Hamtramck Public Schools to make sure that we are preventing substance use within the community. And so we partner in several different ways. We have several junior coalitions with our middle school groups and we're starting a high school group as well that's also focused on substance use prevention but also mental health promotion and just general wellness. We also like to partner with the schools for events like this specifically, so that way we can make sure we're connecting with the community and connecting with other students within Hamtramck as well. I'm Chief Matt Wyshelski with the Hamtramck Fire Department. We're here at the Hamtramck Public Schools Family Fun Day, passing out some fire prevention materials for the kids and getting our message out. Uh, we've got all kinds of stuff. We have coloring sheets. We have plans here to make your uh, home safety home safety pins, uh, junior firefighter badges for the kids. So come on out, get some information, visit all of our wonderful people here today. We have our police departments over here, DTE. We have all kinds of community groups, so thank you. Chief Ann Moyes, and we are here today at Pulaski Park for their back to school carnival. So please come out and join us for a lot of fun. There's a lot of giveaways and a bunch of different tables and vendors. We've got some fun items. You can visit a police car, the fire truck, do the bounce house. So come on out to Pulaski Park. They're here till two o'clock. So we've got some stickers and some coloring pages, and we've got some bus safety. 
This reminds everybody when you see the red lights on the school bus, you have to stop and wait until the lights go off. That's for the safety of our children. So make sure that you do follow those directions. We've got some fun bracelets and flashlights. We're giving away and all kinds of fun things. My name is Jesse Quek. And I'm Rachel Baser. Um, we're with Eastern Michigan University Center for Health Disparities, Innovations, and Studies. And we're here to give out more information about um, healthy food and about physical activity, as well as an event that we have coming up on, uh, on Sunday called the Hamtramck Active Living Festival, where we're going to have information um, about bikes. People are going to be able to practice riding a bike. We're also going to have a resource fair, so we're letting people know about that. And then we've got some great games out, and we're giving away markers, pencils, uh, chopstick, wipes. What else do we have for? <laughs> That's about it. Pens. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> lots of things. Yep. So we have lots of great information. So come and see us. <laughs> Hello, my name is Rashonda Temple and I am a community nutrition instructor with Michigan State University Extension. I have my coworkers with me. I'm Lexi Griggs. And I'm Grace Henry. <laughs> and we are here at the Pulaski Park today handing out nutrition information. We teach free nutrition classes in the community all throughout Wayne County for kindergarten all the way through 12th grade, families, parents, everyone. So we're just handing out some information we have some models on the table to show how much fat salt and sugar is in some of our common food items we have some activity books and pencils and bookmarks and recipes to hand out and yeah feel go free green. to come by go yeah go green <laughs> hi my name is joseph i am from muslim family services Econo relief here in detroit um, today we are giving out backpacks at the hamtramck public school event and as you can see behind me, we ran out of all of our backpacks. So we distributed all of our backpacks to the kids here for our back to school event. And in the month of August, we are distributing about 1,500 backpacks to different locations uh, within our organization. So we'll be going to different cities in the Detroit area, metro Detroit area, and distributing backpacks. And also today, we're handing out flyers just telling us, or telling people a little bit about their, our a little bit about our organization and what we do. So uh, we are a social service organization, so we have transitional housing, food pantry, uh, free counseling, and uh, rental and financial assistance. So if you want to check us out, you can call us at 313-366-6800, or you can come to our office, and it's located at 12500 Mitchell Street in Detroit, 48212. So come and check us out, and uh, thank you. Hello, I'm Daryl Wilson, Regional Parent Mentor for Michigan Alliance for Families. We are a statewide organization. We are grant funded through the Michigan Department of Education Office of Special Education Programs. And we are regionally located to get involved with our communities and to be able to reach our families and give them information, support, and resources regarding special education services throughout the state, but more importantly, throughout their community. So I am a regional parent mentor. I've been involved in this fair for, this is my third year. And it's such a great turnout. We get to reach uh, all different kinds of populations. And we provide information in different types of languages and give all individual support for parents and students of children with special needs that have IEPs that need to receive special services in the public schools. Thank you so much. Hi, my name is Vicki Smith. 
I am the principal of Early Childhood Elementary and we are currently under construction for new air conditioning, new windows. We're super excited. So a lot of our materials are packed. So with the limited supplies we do have, we're passing them out to our younger children to make sure that they get a book and a mini backpack. Over here is my administrative assistant, Kathy. Miss Kathy, you can say your last name. Spanovsky. And over here is our ELD teacher, Mr. Bo Saka. Say hello. Hi. Good to see you. And we're working here so that we can meet some of our students in advance, recruit some students to say, come on to Hamtramck, and we want to make them feel very welcome here. So whatever we have that's not packed up, we're passing it out to the little guys. Hello, I'm Angela Parkman, the Hamtramck Public Schools Director of Special Education. We are here today with our Family Fun Fair just to make sure that students are off to a good start for the 23-24 school year. Hello, my name is Miriam Amaros. I'm ELD Interim Director uh, for English Language uh, Development. And we are making sure that the, at the fun fair that we are here to support the families, to provide them with the necessary information about enrollment and uh, about English language development program, which in our district is amazing. Jackson, coordinator with the Hamtramck Recreation Department. We're here today at the Family Fun Fair advertising our recreation programs. We're a year-round um, organization that offers programs for ages about three to adults. Um, we have after-school programs, summer programs, um, field trips for youth, families, and seniors. And we're really excited to be here with Hamtramck Public Schools. Hi, I'm Afreen Alvi. I'm the principal at Dickinson East Elementary and Primary Public Schools. Uh, we're here for the Family Fun Fair to recruit more students and to say hello to the ones that belong to us already. Um, we're giving out books and other treats to the kids. Um, this is Miss Plan. I'm the math titleist at Dickinson East as well. Um, free books. Come get them while they last. Thank you. Hello, um, I am Destiny Brown. I work with Global Detroit and pretty much our mission is to help grow economics through immigration inclusion. I work closely with the neighborhood team and what we do is connect native Detroit residents with um, new incoming um, immigrant residents or residents who've been here but are new to the um, new to America and we connect them do different project planning uh, and community organizing to pretty much be able to grow social capital um, just through fostering authentic relationships. We have an upcoming community festival on August 19th that we would like to invite everyone out to. Um, it's gonna be at Jane Field from 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. Uh, Tamina is one of our community participants. Would you like to say any words about Yeah, this program event is for our like um, Ingus, Ingus people, Ingus in our community, so we're gonna invite them to involve in our community and the festival what we are doing so it's like a kind of learning uh, 
event so people are gonna come and we teach them what we are doing so it's gonna be help them for our communities yep so we'll have some workshops to be able to provide folks with opportunities to learn new skills um, as well as be able to engage them and give them information around different cultures and some of the practices that they do um, in different cultures around the Detroit community um, in addition we have some resources for local small businesses. We don't have our small business team out with us today, but that's just some of the gems of Global Detroit, and I hope you guys come out on Saturday. Thank you. Hello, my name is Sophia Ortiz, and I'm here with Susie and Anthony. We're from Samaritas. We provide, we're from New Americans, and we provide refugee resettlement services, and we're here helping at the, um, uh, the school public Camp Tramic event, helping the community and getting connected with the schools and other services that are out here. here. So we are supporting the, um, the immigrant community here in Hamtramck, and uh, we're just here to support the event. Thank you so much. <laughs> Good afternoon. We're Cognizante here representing um, our team. We have Cynthia, Michelle, Quinn, Austin, Don, and myself. I am the community outreach specialist. And we're serving the people here in Hamtramck through a federally contracted uh, project. We are handling the Medicaid unwinding. Uh, if there are any questions, they can reach out to us at our contact number, which is 313-572-1452. Would you like to add? No, that's good. Thank no? you. No, thank you. We're educating residents about Medicaid unwinding. Yes, we're educating the residents about the Medicaid unwinding. We do have literature here at this event. Hi, I'm Will Council with the uh, Detroit FBI. I'm one of the community outreach specialists and I'm here uh, enjoying this wonderful community event, sharing some safety information as you can see on our FBI table. We also have information regarding employment. So hopefully folks are coming out and they're enjoying themselves and they have an opportunity to see uh, the FBI uh, in a very uh, positive way. All right, thank you. Hello, my name is Desha McDaniel. I'm here representing Gleaners and we're here today uh, to give out resources on our food bank program, our volunteer opportunities, and we have numerous uh, sheets for recipes here as well. And this is Cassandra. She works with the Gleaners as well. Uh, 